Hello, my name is Chef Rodrigo Puente. I'm here at the PSJA Child Nutrition Program. Today we'll be making a slamming strogurt, which is uh, really nice for this hot summer time that we're coming up on. Uh, today we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna take fresh strawberries and some vanilla yogurt, combine them to make little uh, icicle pops uh, for you to enjoy. This will be a great project to do with your parents. Uh, please do not try the cutting anything without your parents' permission. First, what we're going to do is going to wash our strawberries. We already pre-washed them, so these are nice and clean. We're going to slice the strawberry. What you want to do is protect your thumb. Put your four fingers in the front, your thumb in the back, as you can see right here, how it's behind it. What we're going to be using is a chef knife. Uh, this, this knife has been made so it could pivot on this point right here, so it'll never come off your cutting board and cut your fingers. It's going to rest on these fingers right here. And as you can see, I cannot get my thumb as long as it's behind the fingers. That blocks like a little wall. So you hold it like so. First, you're gonna take the stem off and you discard that. What you're gonna do, you're gonna slice it down the middle and then again in half, so giving you four little pieces, like so. Okay, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take one piece of your strawberry, one quarter. Remember, holding your fingers this way, four in the front, thumb in the back, and you're gonna slice. As you can see, my knife is not coming off the board. It's being protected by these uh, fingers right here, the four fingers. So, and there you go. Now you have your strawberries sliced nice and small so they'll fit into your ice tray. What we're gonna do is mix some, uh, two cups of strawberries and four cups of vanilla yogurt right here. Uh, I've already pre-done that already. They're in here. We took both of these items. As I said, if you don't have a regular a measuring cup, like so, uh, you can always use one of your cups like your mom and dad has at the house for coffee. You just make sure they're clean. All right, and we can use a tablespoon as well. And you can use a regular spoon if you need it. We're gonna use this, it's really important, so we can put it into the slots. It's the perfect size for it. So you're gonna take your strawberries and your yogurt, put them into your mixing bowl. What you're gonna do next is you're gonna use a whisk, which is this little thing right here. I know you've seen it in your house. Most of us have it. What it does, it makes all the ingredients run into these little wires, and it mixes them up, like so. And once you got it nice and mixed, you're gonna do is get your uh, tablespoon if you have your measuring spoons. If not, use a regular tablespoon. Okay. What you're gonna do is you're gonna get some of that mixture, of the vanilla and the strawberry, and put it like so into your slot. You're gonna do one and two. That's gonna be enough because if you overflow it, they're gonna stick together and you won't be able to get them out. So you can just continue doing that until you have them nice and uh, full with two spoons each. This mixture right here that you see will make two of these trays, two ice trays. Once you have them all full, what you're gonna do, you're gonna take a towel. So you take your towel, wipe all the sides, because remember they're gonna freeze, and wherever you have some yogurt, that's where it's gonna freeze. And you don't want that. You want them to be nice and neat. You might wanna want to, uh, kind of slam them down a little bit, so it'll pack in the yogurt. Okay, what you're gonna do after you have them all full, you're gonna put little toothpicks in them, like so. And then you're gonna freeze them for about an hour, hour and a half. And they should be ready to go. Okay, as you can see, uh, our finished product is right here. This took me an hour and a half to freeze. Uh, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna pop them out from your ice tray as so. They'll come out nice and pretty like that with a little steak with a toothpick. And you're ready to eat like a little icicle. But it's nice and nutritious and healthy. So what you're gonna do is put them right here. Put them on a tray so you and your friends can enjoy your family, especially when it's nice and hot outside. And there you go finished product.